night, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Eric Clapton Crossroads Guitar Festival. It's amazing to be able to have the opportunity to be in the room with a lot of people, a lot of legends, a lot of history. Be able to always look back at something like this and 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 know it was uh, filled with top quality and and great songs and great musicianship. When I put a set list together, uh, it's kind of unnerving a little bit because you want to be able to pay tribute to the and homage to the to the blues. I think the blues has, has influenced so many forms of American music, or pretty much all American music, from jazz to uh, rock and roll to even hip hop. And I think it's still the foundation for all popular music. I think the guitar is an element in, in musical part of all forms of music has been always been there. It's just that it's not driven by the big guitar solo. And that's probably due to the fact that everyone was soloing and it kind of got, you know, to a point where the beautiful melodic guitar solo was overlooked for something that was just kind of showy. And so that maybe that took a back seat because it became too generic. The genesis of it was, was something that had more feeling than flash to it. And so that's something that I feel like is going to, uh, I, I don't know that the guitar solo will be, come back uh, immediately, but it, it's always gonna have its place in music because it's al already been recorded and, it, and kind of monumentalized in the history of music. Yeah, I usually play uh, a Martin acoustic that's plugged into a, sometimes a twin, sometimes a Princeton, and then I play a, a Telecaster into a twin. Well, I like a deluxe as well. It's an old parlor, Martin, and then I play, sometimes I play a hollow body, old Gibson. I consider my, myself more of a songwriter than a, a guitar player, so it's always been my vehicle to, to write songs and to, to get to a mode of state that people can connect to. And so that, that's really the you know, biggest purpose I have for the instrument. I think there's, there's uh, a two-tiered thing of, of connecting yourself with the song and then allowing the people, the listeners, to connect to it as well. You know, ideally you try to get beyond the, the fear or the fright of, of performing in front of people and uh, let them in and then also let yourself kind of perform the song and allow the emotional and spiritual side to come through and so that others can, can share that with you. 